Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this video I want to show you guys what I believe to be the best voice recorder app for Android at the moment. Um, so I went ahead and compared about 10 different ones. A few of them have really annoying ads, a few of them don't really seem to work at all, and then a few of them just have an ugly interface. But this one, Voice Recorder by Quality Apps, I will show you the link in the store right now, and I will also put it in the description for you guys. So it's called Voice Recorder by Quality Apps. I'm finding to be actually pretty solid, um, both in the quality you get out of the recording, but also it doesn't bombard you with many ads, and the interface is just quite nice. So let's go ahead and just test this app out really quick. So like pretty much any voice recorder app, you have a few settings, we can navigate over there. As microphone adjustment, you can't really do anything about that in the free version. Um, but the device auto control, I think it works fine because in my tests it basically sounded just fine. Um, so let's see, what can you change? You can set whether you want it to record as an mp3 away file, uh, .mp3 by default. Um, .wave generally tends to be uncompressed. Uh, recording quality, you can choose basically uh, how high you want the quality of your sound to be higher. Uh, kilohertz is going to mean bigger file size, but usually that's fine. I mean, audio doesn't really take up that much space anyway. And I imagine if you had a device that had, let's say, stereo input, then you could probably record in stereo and sort of mono there. And you can also toggle off a couple things at the bottom, hiding the icon on the status bar and preventing standby mode from happening. But in general, it's really simple. It's straightforward. And uh, on the left-hand tab, you can see all of the files that you have previously recorded, so it's really easy to access those. You can press down on one if you want to go ahead and share it, or if you want to view details about it, or even change the name. So while you're recording, it'll show the audio levels of the input that's coming in from your microphone. And when you're done, you just hit the record button a second time to toggle it off. When you're done, you can come over here and basically find your test files, so I can play one of those for you guys now. Here's a quick extended test on the voice recorder app. So I'm just basically talking into my phone's microphone from a few inches away. And uh, let's see how it is when I'm a little bit further. And a little bit further, this is about two or three feet now, arm's length. So talking still, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I guess I'm going to stop it. So that's just coming off of a cell phone microphone, so overall I think it sounds just fine for that. So that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, if you're looking for a voice recorder app, this is the one I would go ahead and use. Uh, there's a lot of comparable apps out there on the store, but once again, you don't want to get bombarded by the ads. Uh, the interface here does look fine, and the sound quality that actually comes out of it is fine as well. Um, also another thing, it doesn't seem to limit you and how long the duration of your recordings can go on for, and that would be a pretty big downside. I did notice one of the apps out there has that. So anyway, I've been Chris, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in my future video content.